What's up, everybody? My name's Head Cat, and welcome to the first episode of Dark Souls. Uh, I pre-ordered Dark Souls 3, and with it quickly approaching within the horizon, I got a redeemable cold, cold, a redeemable code for Dark Souls when I pre-ordered Dark Souls 3. And I've never played a Dark Souls game before, and I've played a little bit of this already, and it looks like it's a lot of fun. Uh, it's, I'm having, I'm having a hell of a time with it. So I hope you guys, uh, I hope you guys enjoy the, enjoy the video. Okay, now we have to pick out a sweet, epic name for our character. So I'm thinking... Dich... Nope. I'm thinking Dich Pumpus. Seems, seems like a pretty, le pretty legit name. Alright, I'm gonna be a... Uh, what is it? I'm gonna go with a knight because it's pretty, pretty much one of the basic ones. Dills opens any basic lock. Yeah, I'm gonna go with that one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Dick Pompas has got a tiny head. Oh, that's gonna be perfect. Oh, that's oh that oh I'm I'm so doing that. Um, okay, I'm gonna go with the commoner face. What kind of haircut would Dick Pompas have? Dick Pompas to me seems like he'd have a ponytail. And uh, let's go with silk. Sure, I mean, you know, fuck it, why not? Why not? In the age of ancients, the world was unformed, shrouded by fog. A land of grey crags, arch trees, and everlasting dragons. Oh, that's badass looking. This is really cool. But then there was fire. And then there was a fire, was fire that for some reason burned all the ashes that were already burnt by fire. We'll go with that. And cold. Light and death. And of course, Light and light dark. And dark. This went from an icy hot commercial to a Star Wars themed commercial, I guess. The light side and the then dark side. From the dark, you know, do they actually they call came. the evil side of the... F no, the no, yeah, they do. They call it the dark side. Do they call the good side of the force the light side? Like, I, I don't... I don't get that. Huh. Somebody needs a haircut. Nito, the first of the day. <laughs> oh, Nito. Cool. Nito. He's, he does pre look pretty neat. The witch of Isaac and her daughters of chaos. God, that's a lot of girls. Gwyn, the lord of sunlight and his faithful knights. And the furtive pygmy, so easily forgotten. He's going to be the biggest badass out of the entire group. That's Clifford the Red Dog, but just demonic With version. The strength of love. I don't know, I feel like that's a Zeus knockoff. That's badass. Oh, so Oh, so is that a dragon that betrayed the other dragons? What, what a Benedict Arnold! Cocksucker. Thus began the age of mm -hmm. But soon the flames will fade, and only 
And the burnt city of ashes will finally become back to the city of ashes. Because that makes sense. Oh, my eyes on fire. Oh, God, my eyes on fire. LASIK surgery gone wrong, I take it. Fire orb. Pyromancer, which improves upon fireball. Oh. Oh, yeah, you can be a pyromancer. The pyromancer, you sit there, obviously, just throw fireballs, but I don't know. Yes, I, on my indeed. last playthrough, I was playing around with it, and you can throw fireballs, but at one point, it like I guess it stops, and I don't know why. I haven't got that far into the game, and I don't know that much of the detail for it. This is like the more fucked up version of the Underground Railroad. I mean, I would kind of want to go north. It's a lot less, it's a lot more cooler, a lot less hot. And there's my badass self. That looks nothing like the face I chose. Uh, excuse me, can I keep my roommate down here? Cool. He's got the glowy ass. <laughs> that's not an item, that's just a really, really long, gross fart that he's got going on. Okay, I'm going to use these because I don't really remember all the controls. Okay, right stick, of course. Attack. I remember the lock on. Ah, get off. Oh. Strong attack. Easy enough. Oh, you're not dead yet? Okay. Look at that ugly fuck. Dude, he is just chilling in a room full of gold. Okay, now what was this? Hold B to dash. Double tap to jump. Knew that one already. Come on, bro. Come at me. Come at me. What the? He's over there just taking a piss. He's like, oh god, I just wanted to pay a loan. All this is actually his piss. He's been doing this forever. The little bit that I have played, and I haven't gotten very far into my last playthrough. Uh, I know quite a bit of what's going to happen. Use the bonfire to recover HP. I know kind of what goes on. Um, I've gotten to one point where I'm at this big long bridge and then the, just this dragon just comes in and just burns everybody to death. Oh god, oh, it's the heaviest door lot. Uh, yeah. Okay, now you can't really see him. Oh, now you can. Look at that big ugly foot. We get to fight him. So I'm just going to go ahead and beeline it right out this motherfucking door. And I'm gone. <laughs> I mean, because look at that. There's no way I'm fighting that thing with this broken ass little hilt. At least the bonfires are generous in this game. Okay, what was this? Get your shield. Oh god, the roll sucks. Oh, 
How do you equipped? Equipped, equipped. Brian, why are you being so weird? Don't you know you can equip? I'm sorry, Family Guy thing. Where you going? Huh? Where you going? Let me stab you. Let me, let me just, let me just, just, just come here. Ooh, broadsword. I didn't get that one on the first walkthrough. Oh wait, no, I I, I played as the pyromancer. I got the uh, the hand axe. I'm glad I missed. Dead? Not gonna drop anything? <laughs> Come with me! I want to show you something. Okay, you see that guy in there? And I know I'm probably gonna play through this like it's... Like I've been doing it forever. Uh, that I've already played through a whole lot. But I haven't. And that's gonna fall down this way, so I'm gonna move. But I look. Yes. Okay. Just just give me the flask. Just give me the flask. Oh. And No. And that's a salon key. Okay, cool. And uh, you know what? I hate to do it to you, buddy, but I'm a, I'm I'm just gonna take you off. I need those souls, man. I need those souls. It gives me a hundred souls. Replenishes the Estus flask. And I think there was something over here. There is... But I can't get to it. Okay. Can't get to it. Wow, I move really slow compared to what I had. I guess the class... Like, since I was a pyromancer in the last one... Uh, he has no armor in the night since he's... Got, you know, all the armor. Just, whoa. Makes him just really kind of... Oh, I can... Okay, dual wield. Cool. Jump kick? No, that didn't say jump kick. Come at me, bruh. Come on. Yo. Whoa. Slow down. They really don't do a whole lot of damage. I'm gonna go back to my shield, though. Nope. See, he just rolls so slow. Right, what was that? Plunging attack? Okay. You go in there and then you, you fight the guy. Critical hits behind you. Whoa! Let me pair. Let me pair. Whoa! Oh! Yeah! Yeah, yeah. Give me anything? We're just chilling. <laughs> oh, he's got the shimmy shakes. Oh, he's got the shakes. <laughs> oh, man. They had to have intentionally done that with these games. As, like, a stress thing. Because you'll get into this, I guarantee you, you can play it. And you'll just get so aggravated. Just so mad. I guarantee you, you'll just get so mad. You are fucking disgusting looking. I actually never stopped. I just kind of plummeted to my doom. Oh, he jumps up there. Oh. Horrifying. Okay. Okay. Oh, God. Oh. How do you dodge again? I like that. Okay. Do your little butt slam. Let me just tear into you a little bit. This is a lot of back and forth. Oh, jeez. There's a lot of reach on that thing. There's going to be a lot of back and forth in this. Oh. <laughs> whoa, dude. Whoa, 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 whoa. Get out. I died right at the very end of this last fight on my first playthrough. I had thrown a little fireball at him and I had done enough damage to end his life. And he still killed me. Come on, bro. Come on, actually. Come on. You gotta hit me at one point. You gotta hit me at one point. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Give it to me. Oh, yeah. I got it. 
Hoi y'all! Ha <laughs> ha, you big bitch! What now, son? What now? Big Pilgrim's Key. Sweet. And I got a little bit of humanity back. I'm no longer insane. Okay, there was a thing up top. I think, and I think I can use my Pilgrim's Key to get up there. Now, I could be wrong, but I think that's a thing. Alright. No, okay, none of these guys were set. But this is this is this is fun. I'm gonna enjoy playing this. This is gonna be a good series. Well, not a good series. Well, actually, I hope it turns out to be a good series. But uh, this is gonna be a lot of fun to play. I, I really enjoyed this game for what it is uh, at the beginning. Whoa! What? What are you doing? What? What are you doing? Get out of the ceiling, you weirdo! Well, oh, that's that's funny. That's funny. Okay, that that shit's funny right there. Mm, what's down here? I think I killed the boss and then that was it. Okay, that's just the way to get back up there. Ooh, what is that? Ooh, what is that? Ooh, piece of candy. Oh no, that's nothing. Is there anything over here? Fake wall? I've been told there's illusionary walls in this. So... Uh, that, that's what I'm looking for right now. That, and I'm gonna try to get up to that one door that was locked. Maybe I've got it. Maybe this uh, pilgrim's key will get me into it. It's kind of a long shot, but that's what I'm hoping for. Oh, how do you get in there? How do you get in there? I want in there. Get off me! <laughs> the ragdoll physics are just perfect, though. I love it. It just makes me happy. It makes my soul grin. I didn't know my soul could smile, but it, my soul has feelings. Okay, did this work? It's locked still. Come on. Come on. Humanity S this flask. Okay. Alright. Be a dick about it. I know there's an illusionary wall here. It's it's somewhere in here. Um I'm gonna look that up. I will return shortly. Okay, just kidding. I lied. I have completely wasted my time and everybody else's time here. Uh, just get out of here. Get out of here. <laughs> Come on, stretch. Stretch. Stretch it out. That big ugly fuck jumped up there and hit that thing. I can't even believe that. That's nuts. That's bananas. Ready for the heaviest door that I'll ever encounter in my entire life. Oh, God. Ugh. I'm so beast. So strong. Good, good job. Go straight ahead. Yay. I did it. Yay. <laughs> what do I have in store for me at the terrors at the top of the hill? That'd be a good band name. Terrors at the top of the hill. Only in the ancient legends it is stated. Oh, that's a big ass crow. Grackle, crow, blackbird, whatever you want to call it. The undead asylum in pilgrimage to the land of the ancient lords. Lordran. Lordran. Okay, cool. So I'm guessing that's where I'm going now. Is to Lordran. L Lordran. It's a place. <laughs> Thank you for choosing Blackbird Airlines. Have a nice flight. Well, that was lovely. Now that I'm out of that hellhole. Firelink Shrine. Okay, and this is like the main basis to the area where you can go and no anything will come after you or whatnot. Okay, there was one thing that I wanted to do and I finally figured out how to do it. I have to go over to my Estus Flask, okay, and I have to use my humanity. This gives me one humanity and I'm just going to use 
two of them because the humanity can be used if you don't have any Estus flasks to heal yourself because the humanity will give it to you all back. But I need to reverse the hollowing. Offer humanity and reverse hollowing. I have no idea what that does. You revived the hue. Oh, oh, okay, okay, cool. Well, let's level up real quick. My vitality, my strength, my dexterity, my dexterity. Hell yeah, I'm sure. All right, nice, cool. All right then. Well, let's talk to this guy. See what he has to offer. Wow, I don't think I ever talked to this guy. I think I just ran right past him. Must be a new arrival. Let me guess. Fate of the undead. Can I lock on you? No. Well, you're not the first. But there's no salvation here. You'd have done better to rot in the undead asylum. But too late now. <sighs> well, since you're here, let me help you out. There are actually two bells of awakening. Two? One's up above Whoa! In the undead I didn't even know there was one! The other is far. The Undead the Church and the Blight Town. town. Blight Town. Know? Void of Light. Sounds like a welcoming place. Brilliant, right? Not much to go on. But I have a feeling that won't stop you. So, off you go. It is why you came, isn't it? To this accursed land of the undead? <laughs> Creepy super villain laugh. Well, all right then. So we're gonna go down there, and I guess that's gonna be the end goal to this entire game: is to go down to uh, the lightless town and up to the undead church to ring those two bells. But anyway, that's actually all the time that I have for for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, remember to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. It would really help me out. And hopefully, I'll see all you guys in the next video. And as always, game on. <laughs>